We put a few extra backups on there before oh, we no, get no, on no, the no, studio. No. For sure, for sure, for sure. But yo, we back. Six views uncut. Episode 68. Um, uncut segment. Six views uncut. Six uncut. uncut. Surviving uncut. Sophia. <clears throat> what? I seen that on your list. What's that all about, fam? Fam, I've been seeing it all over, bro. And it's been like one of the craziest stories of the week. So, a woman accused of scamming LA influencers by posing as a friend of Jeff Wittick and Jeff, Jack Harlow. What's popping? So, we have, uh, and this story is courtesy of yourtango.com. <laughs> Influencers, influencers in Los Angeles are coming forward with accusations that they were the victims of an alleged scammer, Sophia Nur, after, I guess, uh, calling her surviving Sophia, went viral, viral on Twitter. Several influencers and social media stars, including Jeff Wittick, Ricky Thompson, and Denzel Dion, not Washington, went on Twitter spaces, a new feature on Twitter that allows users that have live audio conversations sharing their experience with Nur, who is supposed publicist. She alleged stole a 11 million by scamming Damn. her way into both high profile Los Angeles events and friends groups posing as a victim of horrific experiences and asking influencers for money. Mm. <clears throat> so yeah, fam, she was putting on the scammers, bro. Telling people, yo, my mom died. This and then the third. I need like 5K for this and that and the third. There's stories of man them saying, yo, they met her this and that in place and she seemed distraught. She just came from a funeral and the man gave her money and a little uh, to get on the plane and gave her a little bit of extra money so she could get home safe and he didn't he didn't mind you know what i'm saying i'm just like oh lee oh man i don't know if i'm mad at her yo so even the next rumor is too <laughs> she's from rex uh, uh, okay listen i don't want to say anything and salute to all my mollies out there <laughs> but i'm there looking at her picture and I'm like, is this a Toronto girl? <laughs> the last thing that made it big was like, there's a legend that it's a Toronto thing. Mm. I don't know that if that's a part of her for this. Like, if she's saying that, like, she's from Toronto and she's not, I don't know. But yeah, fam. I looked at the last Be name. Beautiful looking uh, young lady. Salute to the Mollies. Salute to the Mollies. Yo, this is a super dub for, for the ladies. I'm not going to cap. I rock with it. I ain't because, mad at her. Yeah, like, I'm not mad at the situation. Like, yeah, you went down and see the other picture, right? Eh? Damn. Ah! <laughs> yeah, man. She's bad. She bad. Yeah, she that's queen. But yeah, like, this, this is... I like seeing this, man. You know what I'm saying? Nobody was hurt. You know what I'm saying? Um, no husbands. Uh, things got involved. Wives mm. got involved. You know what I'm saying? She finessed the things nicely. Stress properly she just she just hey that's why i read it like no oh, oh, sorry like toronto man's to say neatly neatly mm. Mm. yeah she did it neatly still i listen i'm not condoning of any criminal activities or anything like because she did some frauds and all that but if the streets gotta eat fam if you stupid enough to get finessed like i'm sorry fam how is it a fraud she finessed him out of all that money fam it's not it's not facts but if you're dumb enough to do something like that, if if you again, if you don't do your research, is it your is it, is it her fault? <sighs> well, she's still gonna you know because it's a criminal offense, she's still gonna have to. It's gonna be her fault. <laughs> <laughs> she came up with the plan, right? But same way, what if like, she didn't come up with the plan? A sucker is born every minute, as they what say. What if right? she? <laughs> what if she's really going through situations? She just lies about. Maybe a death or two. It's still it's still technically illegal. I don't know. I don't have a lawyer around me. It's still technically illegal. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Especially for the amounts of money that she's she's getting out of them. Anything five thousand and over, that's grand larceny. So <laughs> yeah, they're gonna look for some years out of her for this, yo. She got eleven mil. I I know there must be men like this that have done that. Yeah. Like a Rico Suave boy and just you know, oh my god. 
Yeah, my wife, yeah. My wife has died. My my, my family has died. In what, what show did they end up on? Dr. Phil. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen this episode of Dr. Phil. Phil Toxicity Psychopath. Yeah, like the woman is convinced that the guy is some guy that is like in love with her and she's sending him thousands. And then like she has the picture of the man. And Dr. Phil bought the guy who's in the picture to show her this guy is this complete other thing fam that's not the guy in the picture picture. this is him right here and he hasn't never spoke to you before and she's still like but brad the things he said to me it's him it's it's really him it's like no you're lying to me catfish like no fam like it's some nigerian no No, have you ever watched catfish yeah that too that's how it's been fam there's episodes where like hi i'm the person i no you're not no. No, that's not you. You can say I, those I, things to I, me. I, 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 no, 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 no. he must have told you that. Yeah. <laughs> There's <laughs> no way that you would have said the things that you said to me when he said to me that night. Yeah, I get, I get what you're saying because yeah. then those kind of people, like you're, you're preying on them, right? Because they're so gullible. You're like, dumb you're as fuck, like, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> like, fam, yo, the Doctor Phil episode, the man had his the, <laughs> the woman's sister. Like, please, Betty, no, don't send any more money. And she's like, no, but he loves me. <laughs> <laughs> he had the finesse claws were deep in her, fam. How much has a girl finessed you for? Finessed me for? <laughs> <sighs> Maybe like an ounce. I was gonna for, my my automatic man brain was about to say nothing. Ain't nobody ever finessed me for shit. But a girl got a jacket out of me before. I think a girl got like eight bills. Oof. They're gonna comfort you. But that's just finessing. That's just finessing. She got an eight bills on me. Okay, so let's define finessing. So, like, we're hoping that we're gonna get the crotches and we didn't get it, or I got the crotches. Or she cut off uh, right after you you gave her the gift. No, we were smashing, and then we were supposed to do something together. Mm. And I gave her the eight bills and she cut. (laughs) See, I haven't heard from her since. Yeah, because I call that more the finesse. (laughs) That she finessed the fuck out of me. That's a finesse because you already all been smash. You all been smashing. And then all of a sudden, all of a she sudden, as soon as a gift is exchanged or some kind of money is exchanged, all of a sudden you fucking disappear. You she finesse me. Always want to smash me too. It's not even like she's yeah. like, oh, yo, come forward. She, That's the finesse. She finesse me nice. No, because the other version is you're simping, right? Like you never got the pum pum, and you're like, well, here's some stuff, here's some, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And it's like then you didn't get it. Like no, nigga, you're no, simping. No, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? I got, I, I got, it. I got it. No problem. Yeah, yeah. Mine, mm-hmm. mine was the same situation. I'm there, knocking it down, knocking it down. I'm enjoying it, and the next thing you know. I was like, yeah, let's go down to and my niggas who, who know the story. They're going to kill me in the comments. Let's go to Dufferin Mall <laughs> and go get a jacket. I got the jacket. I never fucking <laughs> felt the pum pum ever again. <laughs> 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 she was, <"Phew." laughs> thanks, nigga. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I needed that. Winter was coming. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> was, she was just giving me that fucking la leeway pussy for that, for that winter jacket, yo. One girl finessed me for an ounce too, and I was like heavy on the Airbus. Mm. She gave me like sixty bucks, and she was like, "Oh, I'm gonna pay you back." And I was like, "Yeah," and she's like, "Yeah, fuck you, me, my man, have your money." Mm. Like, like, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, fine. I was like, and? <laughs> you like what? Like you were supposed to give me like a bill anyway, so I was like, all right, well, whatever. But the eight bill finesse did it hurt? Yes. <laughs> You'd be mad. <laughs> I'll tell you I'll tell you more why behind the scenes. Mm. But you hurt. <laughs> no, because like I'm saying, like eight bills, I'm like, <coughs> bitch. Where yeah, are yeah, you? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You know what I'm calling? <laughs> Where you been? <laughs> what the fuck? The eight bills hurt because of the grand scheme of things of how things played out in life. Mm. I think that's how I look at it. That's why that eight bill hurts. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Other than that, though, it's it's like I take losses. Like I don't care. Like I've you have to go through losses in life, bro. You have to learn how to move better, how to you know move and do certain things. And I feel like when you when you get so much wins, that one loss because you're not used to it might be a big loss where you don't know how to come back from mm. it. Where I've I've taken losses and I've come back from it, so I've learned how to just deal with things a lot better than now. Like. I'm a very kind of like 
weird moody person you know what i'm saying you you witness it like i get to these stages where it's just like i'm so fucking in my mind mm. but like i just know how to control it to a certain extent yeah yeah right yeah, yeah. i don't let it affect me too much but yeah that, that last did affect me well mm. it bothered me <laughs> it bothered me a lot i think the one with me with the jacket it was just my niggas that really got at me. Like, you gotta get yo, the jacket, bro. And the thing is, it's like, they're like, yo, you, that ting fam? Like, <laughs> you got a jacket? <laughs> oh, Lee. Like that one? Like, I heard about that shit, I think, for like three f- to five years past that after. Like, yo, fam. Like, something else will, be, will come up and be like, well, they shouldn't get her a jacket, fam. <laughs> 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 I'm like, niggas, y'all, y'all ain't forget about that one yet? <laughs> like, holy. Like, that was like 10 girls ago. Guys, like, yeah. let it go, let it go, bro. Nah, fam, when you when when man's them ca- catch you catching an L, fam. <sighs> Anytime they see your shorties now with a good jacket, they're like, yeah, eh? yeah, yeah, it's better than the one that you got. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just, yeah, I ain't clowning you up. Your, your, your brethren used to, did you or your brethren used to clown the girls that you have? Yeah, and that's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> that's a whole other thing to unpack because it fucks with your like perception of life and your choices sometimes you know what i'm saying did it with you did it with me i don't give a fuck bro i, I think it did with me i'm a dirtbag i pine anything so i don't as long no, as it doesn't you, mean you're not gonna pine anything as long as your pokey is fresh then what what, what do you mean perception and how and, 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 and what and girls tr- look pretty and what are not yeah and what the choices of what you well, you know who you're dating and who you're not and all those different things that's all based off of like the perceptions of homies o- over time at least for me and i feel like a lot of people you know what i'm saying mm. when you're seen on road you always have to have the baddest of baddie on your arm but a lot of the times those baddest of baddies be the most problematic bitches that you can meet they can't fuck they can't fuck pussy loose as fuck. Yeah, they you know just what I'm saying. Dry. They just sit there and take dick. No diss to some of y'all baddies out there, but I'm just saying like it's not a diss. It's true. It's like <laughs> we go for the things that like you know, and I feel like we talked about this on another podcast. It's like they're yeah, they're so attractive and whatever, whatever. But it's partially because the homies and like what whatever like videos have shown us and whatever, and we're like that's what the status that quo is supposed cool, to be. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it doesn't necessarily mean that the bitch could be a nice person. Yeah, or a woman I, could be a nice person. <clears throat> yeah, the conversation. That's why I always tell people, like, you can smash a thing, but, like, after that, well, I don't know. Some people just don't care. They just want to smash a thing, right? But, mm. like, can you be around a girl? Can you actually conversate with her? Do you want to be around her? A- if you want to be around a girl after you bust a nut and you just don't want to be around her to bust a second nut, like, that shows you a lot about that yeah. girl. Like, you actually like her. Yeah, but some man will force himself just because she's a baddie and when man them see her them on road with her him on road with her yeah they get yo fam you're a fucking g it yo. builds their confidence yeah and makes them feel nice every time i see this man he's got a baddie with him <laughs> you know what i'm saying <laughs> niggas thrive from that shit fam no for sure so it doesn't make them where they're choosing the woman that they like or whatever whatever they're just trying to choose the things that make other people impressed, impressed yeah you know what oh, i'm saying you, see, you, you you like this that I have. Yeah, but do you like but it, fam? Like it. <laughs> you what time they don't? I don't think they do. Yeah, like she she could barely like fucking spring two sentences together, but she's fat as fuck. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, nah, fam. Like, oh, man. Well, big up all the baddies, big up all the non baddies, the naturals. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Big up, uh, what's her name there? Sophia. Sophia, yeah. Yeah, man. She, Keep, she's doing a bit of both. I was going to say, not, don't keep finessing because apparently that's legal. <laughs> well, I don't think she has any choice. <laughs> she's going to have some court dates that she has to deal with, yo. Oh, at least. So how's she going to pay for it? <laughs> she's yeah. with, her, her t- with the time. Or finesse. <laughs> <laughs> to finesse the guard. Oh, finesse the judge. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah. Speaking about finesse. If you like this video or any other videos like this, there's more that you can choose from. Make sure you like, comment, and share these videos, and make sure you subscribe right now.